I love you.
submarine we talked about. You gotta help me store it for a few days. Floyd, don't go quiet on me or I'll come around and I'll, well, we both know what I'm talking about. Okay, um, all right. The, the bring it around to Pier 400 at the Western Docks. On my way. Look, uh, I'll have a truck to bring you around the warehouse. What's this? The Union man doing an honest day's work? There's nothing honest about this, sir. But this is a dishonest day's work, if ever I've seen one. Hey, we're not hurting anyone. No, but no one except whoever owns that submarine and the, and the mercenary folks on the freighter. Do some research on Meriwether Security Consulting, friend. They'd be on trial for human rights offenses if the U.S. government didn't protect all its contractors from any kind of suit, military or civilian. They're immune from prosecution, and they behave like they are. Murdering, stealing, high on power guns and anabolic steroids. <sighs> Lucky bastards. Look, I don't know about that stuff. Oh, you're right. You don't. Merryweather are employed by the richest, greediest scum on the planet to shit on the poorest and the neediest. So we are going to enjoy shitting on them! Oh, great. I look forward to that. Okay, well that's more like it. I'm here. Oh, hmm. It's around the corner, past the shipyards. Yeah. 
Is that sub covered properly? It'll be fine if we just get there. Are you being short with me? No, 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 sir. I, I'm certainly not being short. I'm just not used to this kind of pressure. If you turn a crew onto a score, you got to be ready for the heat that comes with it. I didn't turn anyone on to anything. You threatened and cajoled and tricked me. You don't want to cut. Just walk away. I can't walk away. You're robbing my workplace and running the show from my home. Deborah's home. No cut for you, no cut for Deborah. You can pull up. So, it looks like we're ready to go with everything. I don't think it's a good idea for us to meet at the condo, so maybe we should... Tell Floyd it is a good idea to meet at the condo. It's a great idea. And tell him we need chips and dip and prostitutes. your little immigration problem, whatever the fuck it was. We're straight. Oh, absolutely, yeah, yeah. You killed people, you tortured people, committed... Here's Trevor. Gee, right! Looky, looky, huh? A bunch of government shitbags and their favorite stoolie. What's he been telling you? Oh, he just said how you guys were happy to help the government in any way you can. Oh, really? Huh? Because I was told that if we helped out with that thing, which we did, then our past indiscretions would be forgotten in a haze of patriotic fervor. Who told you that? Did I tell you that? I'm in charge here, Fruity. Me! You understand? Uh, not quite. Well, can you explain that again? What I was saying! <laughs> oh, you're good. The three cunts. Listen, we need help with something else. Some of the government, some of it is pretty corrupt. Not, uh, not your bit, right? 
Yes, but we're corrupt in a good way. But the agency, they want to encourage panic so they can guarantee their budgets. That's how they get paid. It's a major problem. And now they've secured some funds that we need to use in our fight against crime as a way of bribing corrupt officials. Really? And where are they getting that from? Drugs. Those bastards love to sell drugs. Who doesn't? We think they're going to use this money to finance a war on our streets. And we need you boys to requisition that money for us. The bonds are leaving the terminal in an armored car. Yeah, fuck you, Dave. We don't have time to prepare the right way. <laughs> it's not my concern. I cannot allocate any more resources to this. You'll be fine. Fuck you, Dave. Nice work, Slick. We're gonna be doing pat-downs at the airport before those fucking clowns are done with us. Yeah, fuck you. Hey, hey, look, man. It is what it is. Now, how the fuck we gonna get this done? I don't know. <sighs> I got it. Classic blitz play. It's an industrial area, right? So I'm thinking vehicles. Trash truck the block, tow truck sack them. We get some disguises, and we're gold. We just gotta hope like hell these are the kind of agency men that don't carry a panic button with them. If they are, we deal with it. If and when. If and motherfucking when. I will keep my eyes peeled, General! Thank you, Michael. Hey, no problem. No, really. Guys, a few more details. We'll need boiler suits and masks for this job. The garbage truck. Let's get one from your park. Bring it back to the lot. And there's an auto repair place by the airport where we can get a tow truck. What else? Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Get away. That would be nice. Get something fast and discreet. We park it off the road a good distance from the lot. And make sure it ain't near something we'll crash into driving off. That's it. All right, man, I got you, dog. What? Huh? I missed that. Maybe shout a little louder? Fight me. Fuck, fuck. Shit, you're in way!
truck is at the lot. yourself to blame. Is there something in particular you're looking for? See you again. discount if I could. No replacement for a firearm, but a nice compliment to one. There's nothing passive-aggressive about that. A true emblem of police brutality. There you go. Boiler suits can come off the shopping list. <laughs> 